right now to those huge deals this Thanksgiving holiday. Should you stay home with the family or should you bust down the doors for early best deals? We asked our Becky Worley to make the call. Dinner or deals? Take a look. Thank you. Sign of the times. This year, the insanity of shopping is competing with the sacred triumvirate of Thanksgiving family, food, and football. Stores, a slew of them, are opening on Thanksgiving Day. Kmart, Walmart, Sears, Target. Are you kidding? You want me to shop on Thanksgiving? I think only the turkeys are happy about this. But if you are thinking about skipping the trip to fan to save some cash, well, here's how you do it. Step one, planning. Circulars, too time consuming. This is your weapon of choice. Try dealnews.com to see what they think are the most smoking hot, crazy eddy, nutball deals of the year. Next step, define your level of commitment. You see, there are two kinds of discounts. Decent deals you can get all weekend long. Then you have doorbusters. These are limited quantity, in-store only items that the stores take a loss on. In other words, Bust out your camping gear. The big doorbusters are TVs. On Thanksgiving morning, Kmart has a 32-inch LCD for $97 while supplies last. That night, Sears has a Toshiba 50-inch LED. It normally retails for $7.99. It's marked down to $299. There are other deals. You want an iPad too? Sure, it's at Walmart Thursday night for $3.99 and you get a $75 Walmart gift card with the deal. The Xbox Connect is on sale Thursday night at Target for 50 bucks off. Best Buy is bucking the trend and opening Black Friday morning. They have doorbuster TV deals and this Asus laptop half off at just 250. Kohl's also opening on Friday and they have a four quart programmable slow cooker for just $9.99. No discounts getting me away from what really matters, football. I mean family. For Good Morning America, Becky Worley, ABC News, Oakland, California.